All parties who get conference has appealed to the United Nations to put pressure on India to settle the lingering Kashmir dispute as per the relevant resolutions of the UN Security Council. According to Kashmir Media Service, illegally detained APHC leaders in their separate messages from the jails in Srinagar and Jammu region said the Kashmir dispute between Pakistan and India has become a nuclear flashpoint in South Asia. Indian government has admitted that 701 cases of sedition and offensive against the state were registered from 2018 to 2022 according to Kashmir Media Service the Indian Union Minister of State Nityanand Rai in a written reply in the Lok Sabha revealed that 5023 cases were also lodged under the Unlawful Activities Prevention Act The minister said this during this period 788 people were arrested and charge sheets were filed against 500 in sedition and offensive against the state cases a total of 131 people were acquitted also he said that under the UAPA 8947 people were arrested and 6503 people were named in the charge sheets a total of 550 people were acquitted All parties who get conference leaders have paid rich tributes to the prominent martyred liberation leaders Muhammad Afzal Guru and Muhammad Maqbool Bhatt ahead of their martyrdom anniversaries according to Kashmir Media Service India had sent Muhammad Afzal Guru to the gallows in New Delhi's infamous Tihar jail on 9th February in 2013 in a fake case related to an attack on the Indian parliament in 2001 Muhammad Maqbool but was hanged by India in the same jail on 11 February in 1984 for his role in the Kashmir Freedom Movement the bodies of Muhammad Maqbool but and Muhammad Afzal Guru remain buried in the premises of the Tihar jail after the Babri Masjid Hindutva holders are hell bent upon demolishing the several other mosques in India A report released by the research section of Kashmir Media Service today said the stage has been set by the Modi regime in connivance with the Indian judiciary to convert the historical Gyanvapi Mosque into Hindu temple in Varanasi city.